There's another non-self-proclaimed chatter whose daughter sounds very similar to this. I want to know, is there actually a jabber gene? There's the FOXP2 gene that seems to be important in neuron to neuron connection, but when there are variances in that gene, it seems to cause a pretty severe speech impairment, so that's not it. Then there's the NOVA1 gene, which when activated in mice, makes them make more complicated sounds to the point where scientists now think that's how we learn to speak in the first place, but that just seems to make us human, not necessarily a chatty Sally. Now we know about Robo2, which is appropriately named since just like my toddler's speech, it's called the roundabout guidance receptor 2 gene, and people who have a specific variant of this actually have more spoken words during a phase of early language development. Now, as far as I'm aware, that benefit, the increased words, don't necessarily continue into adulthood, but I'm willing to be called out about that. Yeah, so Robo2, it's the baby talk gene. You think you have it?